at this point, a lot more used to the powers. Somebody's been bad. I approve. Mind if I come in? Time is ticking, so I'll cut straight to the chase. I work in talent acquisition, specializing in a highly unconventional sector for a very particular client. And they're particularly interested in your kind of talent. Fucking stuff up. Putting it back together, altering the fabric of space and time, basic thaumaturgy. My client is only interested in the best of the best. That's where I come in. Your talent is raw, but it's uh, obvious. My client has the means to refine that talent and make the most of what you've got, and I'm not talking about money. Well, not just money. Protection. Power. The best parties in the biz. We're prepared to give you a unique opportunity, a chance to prove you've got what it takes to hang with the big boys and girls. To rule the world. It's up to you to grab that opportunity by the balls. Based on what I've seen so far, you might be what I'm looking for, or... You might end up dead. Time will tell. Tick tock. You have an appointment tomorrow in Brooklyn that I'd uh, recommend you keep. There's no address. Consider this the commencement of your official interview. Find us, or we'll find you. My client has uh, eyes everywhere. Don't be stupid. Late again. Uh, everything seems a little jerky. I'm not sure if it's due to running fraps at the same time, or it's the servers. I'll just assume it's just my system. No, no, no. Too much visibility on the street. They're listening. They're always listening. That's why I keep the dryers running 24-7. They bug my phones, read my mail. They have this place on CCTV. Replace my girlfriend with an android. The Illuminati. I know you know. And they know I know. You know? <laughs> oh, you're wondering why they haven't disappeared me. Shut down my magazine? It's because I play smart. I play along. It's a game to them, you know? It's all just a game. Oh, hi, hi, hi Leah. Don't worry. She's, she's, she's not one of them. She's in my D&D group. Role-playing is the only avenue to resist control. We do nothing, nothing, they don't tell us to. They've been conditioning us in, 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 in every kind of media for years, okay? Example, Pac-Man. That's how they see you. Just, 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 just a little head, just a mind share. And you run through the mazes, the mazes they built, sucking down their pills. The fruit, the forbidden wisdom of Eden, never enough. And you can't shake the fucking ghosts, right? I mean, they're watching you. Their eyes are always watching you. Even beyond death. This all adds up. That's where you'll find the Illuminati. At the dark center. In the ghost house. In the labyrinth. It's right here. Just, just follow the yellow dot road. <laughs> That's all I can say. Well, that was interesting. Get a little more information Look, out of them. who I am isn't important. What is important, what is vitally important, is raising awareness of the truth. You can quote me on that. David O. Screed, editor in chief, a weird nonfiction magazine. Maybe you read us. Or maybe they stumped you. For a warehouse district, a dead neighborhood, this place sure gets a lot of traffic, don't you think? Not hipsters looking for rehearsal space. This is where the deeply incognito go to be found. The underground scene here, it's real deep underground, you know what I mean? First Manhattan, then all of New York. The Illuminati took this city like a fucking virus. They kept on hammering until we let them in. Like those little porn pop-up windows that won't quit. Corruption as deep and wide as those quote-unquote closed subway tunnels under Atlantic Avenue. You want to talk about dark days? Listen, 
We are in the long shadow of 2012. It's hanging over us like, uh, like the fucking Death Star, okay? I mean, I'm not saying it's the end. The Mayans were crazy mothers, but they weren't stupid. 2012 is the beginning of the end. A signal point when all the lines start to come together. That's a nice little touch. Not here. Not here, right? There's only so much I can tell you. Living in their backyard, it pays not to lay a turd on the doorstep, you get me? Okay. Hey, do you think you were followed here? Wait a minute. Okay. So that's kind of cool and interesting. I guess I'm following the yellow dot road on my way to the Illuminati. I like how they discussed it. It's just like one of the conspiracy theorists about them. Honeycomb. Interesting. They really did their research to come up with uh, a lot of the stuff. You can say what you want about the game if you don't like it, but they definitely did their homework. Oh, well, dead end, but at least I found more lore. Well, like the other guy said, led down where they want me to go. This is a bit of a bit much like a labyrinth. Kind of just going all over. Oh, the hand. Yeah, probably makes sense to follow that. What else let's explore? You never know what else you might find. You might find more lore objects. Illuminati graffiti. <laughs> 